Hi. Now, in the last part, we're asked to comment on the skewness and give a reason for our answer. So, just give you a moment, if you haven't done this already, just to pause the video, come back when ready, and you can check your work solution with mine. Okay, welcome back, if you had a go. So, let's see how we do this. Well, first of all, what we know is that, let's just put since here, what we know is that the mean e of x, the expected value of x, we're told is equal to 35 twelfths. In other words, if you convert that to a decimal, it's 2.916 recurring. And what I notice is that the mean e of x, okay, let's just put the mean, turns out to be a value less than the median that we worked out in part D. So the mean is less than the median. And when this occurs, what we have got is negative skew. So we'll just put that in, negative skew. And there you go. That's the answer to our problem. Comment on the skewness. It's negative and give a reason for our answer. And that is because the mean is less than the median. All right.